The mini tin battle starts today. 2020 versus 2023. Then versus now. Let's open her up and see who wins. Old versus new. Who will be with the winner? Put it down in the comments. Make sure you tell me, is it the gal pals or is it the Peldia pals? Which one will win? Okay, let's get started. Let's go fire. Cause of course we're always looking for that Charizard and Let's get rolling. If you're interested, stay tuned till the end to find out how you win today's cards. Cause we rip it to gift it here at Thrill of the Chase. Oh, and we have a hit on the first pack. My goodness, I think this is the third video in a row. What do we have? Oh, a Zamazenta V from Brilliant Stars. Oh, what a stunning card. Let's take a look at it under the microscope. Zamazenta V, looking regal as always. Already first pack with Brilliant Stars, of course, Brilli Brilliant Stars and Evolving Skies coming out of the Gaylertons and Silver Tempest and Scarlet and Violet coming out of the new Paldea Tins. Let's go water. It's one of those things that I just, I have to assume that the new tins are gonna win. New is always better. I know we've already opened a pack and I should have told you guys that at the beginning, but I still think that my good old Scarlet and Violet is going to come in with the win. What do we have here? Electivire for our rare. Evolving Skies is a tenuous set in my eyes. It's one of those sets that a lot of people are collecting, a lot of people are loving, and if you love it, go nuts, let's go water. But it's a set for a lot of people who wanted to collect, just weren't able to because of the soar in prices and everything that came with it. And so it's one of those things that these tins, um, you know, made it a little bit more cost effective. And if you were able to get your hands on it, ooh, a Mr. Muck and a Grim Snarl. Let's get into our you know what? We're going to put Evolving Skies aside as we keep having a chat about it. Pull the old switcheroo! And we'll open Silver Tempest next. You know, it's it's one of those sets that has some beautiful, beautiful cards. I will never say otherwise, but it's one of those pricey sets that just made it unachievable for certain people and that just breaks my heart. Let's go fire Silver Tempest. On the other hand, to me, did not get the light that it should have gotten. There was just so much going on when Silver Tempest came out. And uh, I just wish it had gotten a bit more limelight when it got released. Victini for the rare. So far, so far, the Galar pals, as I, as I named them, are coming in with the win, but let's see. We still got lots of packs to open. Let's go water. Ooh, we've got one today. Venomoth. Wow, oh, I think we might have something. Chasing Nation, we might have something. Ralts, Spinda, Pikachu, Nabat, Ponyta. <laughs> And oh, a Reshiram V. So we've got a V against a V. So we are now tied. Let's take a look at Reshiram under the microscope. Finally, a pull out of Silver Tempest with that white blaze. What a stunning card. Last pack for Silver Tempest. We wanted to do this battle simply because these tins get released almost every year, these mini tins, and I just love them. I think they're really priced cost effectively and they're just a lot of fun. These tins are just so cute and fun. Let's go fire. The last tins, so the Galar tins are from 2020, technically, uh, is when they got officially released. And then the new Paldea tins just got released about a month ago. And we've been wanting to open them for a while now. And so I am so excited that we finally get to open some up. Crocorock and an Incineroar. Okay, we are all tied up. 
Let's get into this beautiful evolving skies. Could you imagine and if we found a Moonbrion out of a mini tin? I think I might break the internet. I think I might break the internet. Could that be, could today be the day? Let's go water. That would be kind of insane, I have to say. And then for me to give it away, the internet wouldn't believe me. They just wouldn't believe me. Lit Leo, Lotad, Kyrim, and oh, oh dear, we have something, guys. What is it? What will it be? Oh, it's a Glaceon VMAX. What a stunner. Oh, beautiful. My goodness. Paldea, you're going to have to have some major pulls in Scarlet and Violet. Let's take a look at it under the microscope. Just as I said, we pull nothing out of Evolving Skies. This beautiful, shimmering, stunning card, Glaceon VMAX. Okay, after that, we're going to go back and forth. We're going to open up some Scarlet and Violet and see what happens. Because my goodness, that just about... Whew! I've got to recover. I've got to recover. Let's go water. Ooh, I've got another one. Primate, Palmy, Tarantula, Ryolu, Sidetant, Team Star Grunt, Zangoose, King Gambit, Toxtricity, and an Amor Rouge for our rare. Okay. So nothing out of Scarlet and Violet, but I still got my hopes up. Quite frankly, that was the first major pull we've pulled out of Evolving Skies, I think ever. Um, my pull rates out of Evolving Skies are 10 times worse than the average. You can quote me and check me on that if someone wants to watch all my videos. Let's go fire. Oh dear gosh. There's another, there's, there's something here guys. There's something. Pyroar Dream Ball. Is this like the best mini tins that that we've just been sitting on? <laughs> oh my goodness. Lillipop, Scrappy, and a Glaceon V for our rare. Oh, look at those snowflakes. Let's take a look at them under the microscope. Double Glaceon, how is this possible? Oh my goodness, those snowflakes. Oh, they just pop off this card. Beautiful. Two Glaceons out of two packs. Oof. How is that even possible? How is that even possible? Okay, let's go into this second Scarlet and Violet pack and see what it has to offer. Let's go fire. My goodness, Sandile, Mareep, Silly Cobra. Are any of you excited about the new set coming out next week? I don't know about you, but I'm pumped. Sandile and a Skeleter. Skeleturge? Skeleturge? A Skeleturge for our rare. My good Scarlet and Violet, you are not batting a thousand today. Usually we've got some crazy pulls coming out of Scarlet and Violet. And Evolving Skies has been has been having having a day. Let's go water. Okay, we cannot go three for three. There's just no way. Especially not me. Come on. Carvana, Dweeble, another Mareep, Drowsy. Oh, look at that cute Eevee. And we have a Victini. Okay, that's more like Evolving Skies for me. Okay, but hey, two amazing pulls. Can Scarlet and Violet come back with a double out of the final pack? Is it possible? Yes. Will it happen? I don't know. You guys will have to tell me the chances of that. Oh, I just did the card trick. Oops, patrol. And that's not how that works. That's not how that works, Steph. I'm getting too excited. Let's go fire. No fire there. Congratulations to last week's winner. Make sure you check back with us next week to see if you won today's cards. 
is as simple as putting a comment down below and subscribing to our channel if you want to win those beautiful, beautiful Glaceons and the rest of the beautiful cards we pulled today and maybe something that's stunning in my hand right now as we speak. Make sure you come back next Saturday. We've got a live for the release of the brand new set. What do we have here? Didene and and then Hillop. Oh my goodness. Well, Gaylar pals, you took the wonderful win. Thank you for watching and we'll see you guys back here on Friday. Don't forget to keep on chasing on. Did you like today's opening? Check out this one next.